So was you there when the whole um, um, band, in, uh, band in the USA thing was going on? Believe it or not, I just got away. Yeah. I got away. They, that thing started in 89. Mm-hmm. I was with Luke to the end of 88, and then I, I got away. I left the label. Why'd you leave? I left because Luke was a crook, man. You know what I mean? Yeah. He was keeping all the fucking money, man. Yeah. You know what I mean? Well, I mean, uh, you want to, I mean, I know you had to go back to go get some money later. Uh, you know, you had yeah, to go back yeah. to go get some money later. Yeah, he was, I mean, man, we seeing you go from an office like this garage mm-hmm. to 500,000 square feet. You know what I'm saying? We you seeing. Know, y'all watching this. Yeah, this money. You going into the executive building. You making so much money. You got to go into the executive building. You making so much money. The RS telling you to buy cars, buy a house, or they going to take the money. Yeah. We seeing all this, but we only getting show money. Right. That's which was good money. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. But I want that record sale money, too. Right. So Luke felt that since we, every time we put our albums, we on tour. You know what I'm saying? I mean, we're going out on tour making four or 500000 Yeah. But... What about the millions you tucking away, homeboy? Yeah, well, on the I record sales. I yeah, see that. So every time it was time to get paid, man, he this nigga had twenty thousand dollars in his mind because the got to be tough album. Mm-hmm. He gave me twenty thousand dollar check, so I called the secretary. I was like, "Yo, Debbie, <laughs> tell Luke, kiss my ass, suck my dick. I ain't coming down there to make no more records." You know so what I'm the, saying? So the first album. Shakers on this album. Nah, gotta be tough. Gotta be tough. Was the hit. Twenty thousand dollars. Twenty thousand dollars. So I told I told Debbie, I said, yo, tell Luke, if I don't have a fifty thousand dollar check here in two weeks, mm-hmm. I'm never coming back. Shit. A week and a half I had that fifty. So that it, it popped up. It popped up. So I was like, yo, Debbie, tell Luke I'm on a next plane smoking <laughs> to make my second album. You know what I'm saying? <laughs>